Hey guys, this is Ledger Cat here. Um, I don't have any editing software right now, so this video is probably gonna suck. But I will probably just show y'all why I haven't put any videos out recently. Maybe put this on the real quick. <clears throat> this is what I drive. Hot Dodge Ram. I actually crashed it on Christmas Day, which sucks. I might put that video up. Oh, no. I don't know. Oh, no. That's debatable. But I've been reasonably busy. And it's fucking cold as shit out here. Even in Louisiana, it's like cold Joe as fuck. Oh, yeah. 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 Just a couple of days ago. He was here. But I've just been busy feeding horses and shit. I just got this GoPro. It works pretty good, I like it. I don't know why I'm driving on the wrong side of the road, I'm not British. Oh, I'm fucking cold. I am fucking cold. My nuts feel like they're about to like fall off. They're, like about to just freeze. And, bur and bust or something. And not in the fun way. You know, there's one way I'd like them to bust. It's this, this is not the way I would like them to bust. Yeah, this is what I drive. The whole dash is gone. <laughs> you get used to it. It used to be a lot noisier because there was a bunch of loose pieces, but I put a bunch of them off, or took a bunch of them off, to in a in a attempt to get rid of the noise. Hopefully, that'll uh, that'll make the video a little less annoying to watch all I know is I'm fucking freezing right now Nuts are about to freeze off. <sighs> well, yeah, I'm just gonna go out, feed the horses, and I'm just gonna record the video, put it up on YouTube because I feel like it. <laughs> I just kind of felt like giving it a little gas, that's all. <laughs> if I like doing it with this GoPro, I'm probably going to buy another GoPro and... Uh, I'm so cold. Um, I'll probably buy a Hero 4 and Hero 4 Silver, and uh, just uh, go and use that so I can put a mic on it. This is like the entry level one you can't even put a mic on. It kind of sucks, but it's an entry level GoPro. It's just for like recording random shit. So I'm just gonna record ran random shit with it, you know? stick <sighs> kind 
I don't want to get out of the truck now that it's getting warm. It is so fucking cold. I need the rubber boots or a bitch to put them on. And they're cold. These boots ain't gonna do shit to warm me up. gloves on too to keep myself as warm as I can because I am cold oh. very 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 cold My nuts are freezing off. And I guess I'll showcase the damage from my Christmas 2015 collision with a mailbox. And it was the sturdiest mailbox I've ever seen. The, uh, this part of this turn indicator busted, came right off. The hood is nice and dented now and scraped. Came along, slammed into the antenna, made the antenna look cool, though. and then it come along, scraped across that, broke that handle. You can still get it open from the side. It's not as easy, see? I can't, but it's it's locked. Um, and then dented that. I don't see how it like went clean on this, and then dented the shit out of that, and then came over here and dented that, and dented that, and that's all the mailbox damage maybe a little bit right here uh, damn squirrel came across the road I didn't know what it was I thought it could have been a dog and uh, I started I was driving and I slammed the brakes and for some reason the rear brakes decided to lock on me when the fronts didn't I got something in my left, in my left boot I might be removing it Anyways, so I went over the brakes locked. I was swerving this way. Brakes locked and threw me this way down, going down the road. Well, I let off the brakes whenever I lost grip. So whenever I regained traction, I started going that way. And I went that way into a mailbox. The mailbox scraped along, along the right side of the truck. And it was all I could do to get out of that ditch. I think I've got to be... I need about half a shit stab my foot. But yeah, it it sucked because I'm gonna be paying a good amount of money to get that fixed because it's not my truck, it's my parents. So whatever. It's one of those deals, at least I'm gonna do it myself and not try to get help. Or anything. You know, it's something I plan on fixing myself, taking responsibility for, because it was my fault that it happened in the first place, even if I was trying to avoid a stray animal. title of this video. I don't know what to talk about. So, I'm just going to feed the horses. And I guess just tell y'all about the horses that I won't be feeding as soon as I have a job. Which should be relatively soon here.
the fuck? Okay, I guess I had to grab one. That's okay, I need to come back anyway. That art. I don't always feed them with gloves, it's just when it's really fucking cold. And these are actually not even cold gloves, these are fucking work gloves. These are for like working on shit. And they work, that's for sure. They'll help you work on shit. And they actually they're they're reasonably cool in the summer. But they're reasonably warm in the winter, and I don't I don't get that, but it works. They're Wells Lamont, and I think we paid like or I think I paid like like twelve dollars for them. They're cheap. They're not expensive at all. Well, they don't have a knuckle guard or anything. Well, they have like padding here, but that's it. They don't have like a knuckle guard or anything like that. They're not. Uh, they're not gloves where you could just punch somebody in the face and not expect to feel it. That big one over there acting a fool. He's diamond. This pretty one over here, who's looking at me from behind a post, is Mondo. The white one is Gray. And the one behind Gray is Mooney. And Mooney's taking a shit. That's real nice. Um, direct the camera and my face away from that. And Gray is the dickhead to Diamond. All the time. Anyways, right now I'm going to put him up. So, I got to grab Mooney because he won't go in by himself. Because we just changed the thing up. Usually, we only have three stalls and we have four horses. So, we feed one out. Well, we used to feed Mooney out and all the rest in. And Mooney's a dickhead and he goes to steal Mondo's food. So, what we've done now... <clears throat> If we feed Diamond out, because Diamond's too nice to... Granted, Diamond's the biggest one. Diamond's too nice to steal anybody's food. He might act an ass when you're, you know, trying to feed the rest, if he's already done. That's why you gotta feed him quickly. I think Mooney already knows what the deal is. I think he already knows he's about to get captured. M Mooney! 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 Come on, let's not be like that. Come to me. Mooney. He's like, I don't want to be captured, asshole. Huh, bud. Huh? Let me see if you, you know me. You know me. You know I got you now, huh? Huh, buddy. Come on, let's go eat. Don't give me no trouble. Come on. Let's eat. I don't think Gray's gonna kick you. Hey. Hey. Act right. But yeah, this one. He's good as long as there ain't no food around. He is food aggressive. Oh, I'm in a bad spot. Oh wow, he actually knows what stall to go to. That's really good. Why are you acting a fool while I got you captured, bud? Gray, what are you doing? I'm gonna have to come from this side today. I don't want to trick him because then he ain't gonna trust me. Hey Diamond. Hey buddy. God, you're so muddy and dusty. You're so dirty. You're so dirty, Diamond. It's been raining its ass off, I guess. Gray, go in your stall. Go in your stall. I don't want to have to come capture you. 
I will come capture you. What are you doing talking to horses? Anyways, this is Gray. He's usually a little better than this. I guess they're acting funny because I'm feeding at what they consider a weird time. I just gotta come trick him. Huh. I just gotta come trick you. But once he's captured, he's good. And that one follows him. Sorry about that. Go on. You always follow Gray. There we go. And now I can close his stall up. And that's the end of it. Alright, Diamond, come with me. I'm going to feed you. It's so nasty and muddy. Pretty much all y'all hear is. Come on, Diamond. Diamond's a sweetheart, though. He's probably like the sweetest one. All he wants to do is come to you and love on you. And then maybe get a treat or two. But I don't think he really cares too much about the treats because. I'm trying to get that without opening and bothering with the gate today. But he's good. He's crowd he crowds you a little bit, but that's it. He's got a lot better than he used to be. Diamond, what are you doing? You know I'm feeding you. Oh shit, I forgot. No, I didn't forget to put their supplement in. What am I thinking? I forgot their salt. Oh well. Y'all can go half a day without salt. God, you're so dirty, dude. Insert, insert awkward dirty boy joke here. I totally would, but I'm I'm good. I'm sorry I rubbed your butt, Diamond. Had to get some of that off. <laughs> I don't think he gives a shit as long as I'm petting on him. Now I don't need this. Because they're all inside stalls. And the thing is, sometimes I'm in a rush and I gotta like let them out as soon as I feed them. And when Mooney's out, he eats quick. So when he goes and uh, when he goes and gets done eating, he'll come and run Mondo out of his stall to steal his food. Cause he's a dickhead like that. Yeah, I'm talking about you. And then when Diamond's out, he just comes and he just chills with these guys. He won't try to steal anybody's food. Uh, yeah, you. Yeah, I'm talking about you. I'm talking about you stealing food. And then when you're going and trying to feed him, he fucking gets right in your way and tries to steal the food out of your hand. So, I've gotten sick and tired of that, so I just changed to feeding Diamond. In the, can you not get in my face? I've just changed to... Really? You're going to pull that shit on me? Well, which way are you going? Calm down. Fuck. Calm down. Which way are you going? I'm right here. I'll go on either side of you. I don't care. As long as you don't try to put your butt at me. As long as you don't get in the way, bud. Anyways. Uh... But yeah, he tries to steal your food from your hand as you're trying to feed him. So he'll like intercept you and try and like fucking get right in your way. So that you have to just put the fucking bucket on the ground and give it to him. And me, I don't play that shit. So I've almost gotten kicked three times. He's tried to kick me because I just, I won't just give him the food. I'll fucking 
go to the bucket where he's supposed to eat and give it to him there. And he don't like that shit. He wants to eat now. He wants to eat out of the bucket. He wants to eat out of your hand. And when you go to fucking pour the bucket, he'll be eating it as it's falling out of the bucket. Out of the little... These buckets. Just to hold the feed until we get it into the feeding bucket. So... He's trying to eat before it's even the even in the fucking bucket. And I'm like, dude, you can't eat that fast. You can't possibly eat that fast. But... As an example... Of me being in a rush, because I do kind of want to go back to the house right now. That was an example of me being in a rush. I'll open their stalls up as they're eating. And this one, and now since he's in one of the stalls. And he's fed after he used to be fed. From bad behavior. Little jerk. Um... Now, he's not their skill figure. And if he does get to, he's not going to steal much. Hey, Mondo, let me get something from your belly. Hey, Mondo, how you doing, bud? You alright? I know, I didn't mean to surprise you. I know, I got a weird blinking thing on my head too, huh? That's weird, huh? I got something on my head. But now, as kind of a reward, now, whenever I'm not in a rush and I have the stalls closed until everybody's done eating, he can roam around, because he's good now. He used to be pretty bad about not acting right now. He's really good. Hey, Gray. This is Gray. I know he's white. When he's really clean, he's actually like white, white. But right now he's gonna be kind of a grayish white, brownish white. He's a soft one. He's one of the soft ones. Mooney's another soft one. He's really soft when he's clean. I mean, this one's really soft when he's clean. So is Mondo. And even Diamond's really soft when he's clean. But the softest one is actually the meanest one. Mooney. Hey, Mooney. Oh, calm your tits. You got shit in your tail, but I'm not touching your tail. I might actually try to clean your tail real quick, so. If you'll excuse me for like two seconds while you're eating. Fucking push me. I'm trying to clean your tail for you. It's okay, buddy. I'm back here. This is hard to do with gloves. It's always something in y'all's tails. Alright, there we go. You're getting fat, dude. Oh, you're getting fat or you got some kind of weird ass growth on your side. But when you start like looking into that. But this one, he's the softest one to pet. He'll let you mess with him as long as he's not eating or worried about food and he's we've realized that he's worse in the winter than he is during the day and not during the day what's wrong with me during the uh, summer the summer he's actually a lot 
less of an ass hat. Yeah. Mud walking. But I think the water is going to be fine. I won't have to fill it today. Yeah. Yeah, it's touching a little metal. I think I'm fine. Hey, Diamond. I'm going to pet on you a little bit. Diamond is the sweetest horse, though. He is the sweetest. Diamond. You want to let me wild you while, I'm, while you're eating? Diamond. How's your neck doing? That's my question. Diamond. Diamond. Look at me. Look. Look. I'm not going to stop messing with your ear until you look at me. You got to look at me. Come on. Up. Up. Bring your head up. Hey, don't step on my foot. I got to look at your neck, dude. Looks like it's good now, though. But Diamond's really soft. Especially in the winter. He's good. I'm about to move your bucket so you don't have to eat in your shit. I didn't think of that earlier. I'm sorry. You about done eating? You look like you're about done eating. You're just going to look the bucket clean, aren't you? you Gotta look that bucket clean. This one will actually play with buckets. I mean, he'll grab one out of your hand. Like, seriously, stop. Diamond. Diamond. Whoa. Calm down. I need to look at you. I need to look at you. Look, it's right here. Calm down. You're just clumsy, aren't you? Wanna grab the bucket? You gotta grab it. You gotta grab the bucket. Wanna grab it? Here, I'm not giving you metal bits this time. He'll actually like grab it, I swear. It's the funniest thing. Cause like you'll be hold I'll be holding those blue buckets over there and I'll be holding one of those and he'll fucking grab it out of my hand and I'll be like, dude, what the fuck? I mean he won't be trying to do nothing stupid, he'll just grab it. He likes buckets. Cause he knows there's food in them. Oh, you're my buddy. Hey. Diamond. I want a hug. Yeah, let me give you a hug. Let me give you a hug. Diamond. See, he's my buddy. Hey, bud. <laughs> He'll actually, like, wrap his neck around you and stuff. Hi, huh, bud. Hi, huh, buddy. Hi, huh, buddy. About done eating? About to go bother the other guys? See what they're up to? I'm about to leave, dude. Hey. He's worried about food right now. Get you some of that hay. See, now, now he gets hay, too. They used to not let him get hay, and there were dicks to him. Let me pull some of this shit out. Because I know you don't like that shit. You won't eat that. You'll just get that stuck in your tail. And your mane. And then I'm going to have to clean it out. So at least let me get some of it all out. But yeah, them, those are the horses. Those are what are, those are what have kept me from. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. These these guys are why I don't play games much. Cause I'm messing with these guys. Hey. I mean, you can call this one diamond. Well, if he's not worried about food. Food comes first. <laughs> but I mean, he's one of them horses, if, if you come out here in the middle of the day, when it ain't feeding time, you can go up to him, and he'll let you pet him. Like, always. I can, I can like, dog up to this horse and pet him. He's so, so friendly. Oh, buddy. You like, you like the petting, huh?
I mean, he'll let you hug on you, hug on him, and all sorts of stuff. He's a people horse. He loves people. You gonna follow me for pets now? You gonna follow me for petting? Is that what you're doing now? Or do you think I got a treat? Think I got a treat? I don't have a treat. I'm sorry. <laughs> you look disappointed. I'm sorry, but I don't. If I had one, I'd give it to you, though. He's like, fuck you. I'm just gonna eat some hay. Oh, well. That's diamond. And them three are just gonna get out of the stall whenever they feel like it. So. That'll be no issue. What? See, he's the friendliest horse. <laughs> what? What? You gonna try to eat my hand now? I'm gonna wipe your spit back on you. Or on us post. That works. Alright. I gotta go. <laughs> that horse would... If he was small enough, I'd have him in a house. He's like a puppy dog. That horse, I swear, was like a puppy dog. <laughs> he loves to be petted on. He'll let you lay down on him, too. He's a really, really sweet horse. Because if, he's like, if he's laying down, and you go and you sit on him or lay down on him, he just, he just gives no shits. He's just like, okay, whatever. That works. That's fine with me. <laughs> He's just like, okay. Just just pet me. That's fine. I don't give a shit at this point. <laughs> at this particular point in time, I I just don't care. He's cool. I like him. That was a fail. That was. Of epic, epic proportions. But yeah. That's the horse. Let me turn that on so I can see it working. I can't drive with these boots, they're not flexible enough. I can't, see? I can barely do that at all. So, okay. Come on, I've got to open our socks with them because socks end up <coughs> abrasing too much. Why? See, it's so fucking. What the fuck? I said they're just happening in my seat. That looks right. I think my driver's seat's broken. But whatever. And I'm leaning too back. Lean. I'm, I'm leaning too back. What is the past tense of lean? What is the past tense of lean? If anybody's watching this and they know that, put that in the comments because I'm like confused on that right now. Leaned? You leaned to it? Yeah, that works. Lint? You lean back too much? I don't know. Fuck it. Whatever. I'm bored and weird. And I just fed the horses. And that's 
pretty much the end of it. Um, as far as horses go, I'm probably gonna keep this up until out of the deal. It looks like I might be getting a motorcycle soon. Like within the next six months, it looks like I might. Or a new, or a new car, I'm not sure. Yeah. Anyways, um, it's kind of funny to see me in an actual real car, huh? Because of all my driving videos on Gran Turismo, drifting, and all that shit. Granted, I'm not going to do any of that shit in this truck, because, <laughs> no. <laughs> I've done it before whenever I was stupid, and I don't feel like being stupid, so. Hey, look, it's a Kia. It's a Kia Soul. And not a pretty car. Not really. I don't like them. I think they're kind of stupid. But, I guess that'll be the end of the video, guys. Hope you guys liked it. Hope it was worth it. I think I'm going to end up doing a vlog whenever I go back and forth to school and work and stuff. So, see what you guys think about that. Is it a good idea? Is it a bad idea? It doesn't really matter. I just want to know what y'all think. But it doesn't matter. I'm going to do it anyways. Or at least try to start. So, I'll see you guys later. Peace out, have a great day, and I hope you enjoyed watching.